Hello my friends and welcome back to my channel. It is about time that we get the Nintendo Switch 2. Not just to play this game here with a better performance and better picture quality. No, also to play of course all of those games with a better performance and a better picture quality. But Nintendo Switch 2 is not the topic today because there is, or I at least, don't have any updates. All but I know that there was some prototype, yeah, pictures leaked but nothing else so i have no idea actually how the nintendo switch 2 should look like what the performance will be if it is supporting hdr which i doubt at least not in the handheld mode but all those things are just yeah i have no idea okay i like to focus on zelda the yeah zelda echoes of wisdom okay where we actually play for the very first time, Zelda, actually. That's how it is, or well, correct me if I'm wrong, but usually we play Link, this time we play Zelda. And when I picked up this game, um, my idea for this video was just, just do a quick video, just play a little bit, record a couple of things, you know, FPS and stuff like that. But I ended up playing for hours because this game here, is just fantastic in regards of gameplay, in regards of graphic design. The art design is just wow, awesome. I love it. But we still have, or there are two issues what we need to talk about it. One is picture quality, which is a minor issue. And then we have, unfortunately, a major issue as well. And yeah, this is called performance. Okay, so let's come straight to the point, performance. And I was actually hoping that at least in the handheld mode, we would have a more or less stable 60 FPS experience. So far as I can tell, the handheld mode runs slightly better because of the yeah, different resolution actually than the docking mode, okay? But the problem is it's still not fixed 60 FPS, okay? So especially when you play on a very big screen on OLED screen, it is, in my opinion, almost man mandatory nowadays to have at least 60 FPS. The problem what we're now facing with Zelda here in this, yeah, in this case is that we are not just losing a couple of frames, which would be, I would say, maybe acceptable. But it looks like because of forced V-Sync or something like that, we're dropping suddenly from 60 FPS to 30 FPS, which is very annoying. And this is happening very, very often, almost all the time when you have a little bit more of yeah, graphic fidelity on the screen. So this is, is annoying, to be very honest, because especially on a big screen, when you suddenly jump or drop from 60 to 30 FPS, the whole screen just starts to stutter and it's a very unpleasant experience. And that's one of the reasons I would like to see the Nintendo Switch 2 in action because I, I, on the other hand, I just hope this Nintendo Switch 2 can actually play this physical copy of Zelda. I hope so. I truly hope. I, I, I Please let it happen, okay? Anyway, so that's why I need the Nintendo Switch 2 because I like to enjoy this great game, which is a masterpiece in my opinion. And I have to say maybe one of the best games so far what I played this year. Okay, so one of the best games, okay? Not the best game, one of the best games, okay? But I like to have at least a stable 60 FPS experience, okay? So this is really, uh, this is costing me a lot of fun in this game, okay? Don't get me wrong, I played a lot. I played, off, I played hours, okay? But again, because of the very bad performance, it is just not enjoyable all the time. And then I would like to talk about picture quality. So what is picture quality for me? So it has nothing to do with graphic in the first place, okay? So again, the graphical quality, the art design in this Zelda game is just outstanding in my opinion. But the picture quality, I so for me, picture quality is, is a picture very sharp? Does it look sharp? Is it over sharpening? Is it under sharpening? Is it too soft? Something like that, okay? So also shimmering, I hate it. I don't like shimmering at all. I don't like motion blur at all, okay? So some sort of motion blur, okay? Object motion blur is actually really nice. Um, this is, or well, those are points for me, or yeah, those are points for me when we're talking about picture quality. So unfortunately, Zelda has also an issue with picture quality when you play this game on a very big screen because then we're talking about um, some sort of a blurry picture 
And also we have some sort of shimmering on very fine yeah, objects, edges, and this can be very destructing. So that's also a reason why I would like to see the Nintendo Switch 2 in action with um, the option that we have games like that actually uh, in a higher resolution. So to avoid actually those shimmering, those um, lazing effects on very fine objects. Okay, my friends, so what is the summary for this video. First of all, you should get this game. If you like Zelda games, get this game. I know we talked about just negative things actually in this video because that's what my channel is. No, my channel is not negative, but you get my point. I'm not reviewing games here. I'm pointing out um, performance or we're talking about performance, HDR implementation and stuff like that. Also picture quality, of course. So this is what I have to complain about in this game. Everything else is just on such a great level. And again, if you play uh, this game in the handheld mode, then uh, because you have now suddenly the very small screen um, shimmering, the stuttering, the frame rate is not as a big problem anymore because when you play on a TV like this here, the 65 inch LG G2, LG G2 or any other big screen or even a, a bigger screen, then you see, of course, the issues um, easier. It's just, that's just how it is because now you have, uh, you can actually see the pixel more or less because it's just a 1080p resolution or the switch is outputting 1080p. I'm not even quite sure what the real resolution from this game is, but you get my point. The bigger the screen, um, the more you see actually the flaws of a game, okay? So again, I love this game as many, many, or as almost all the Zelda games. I just love it, but it's really time to get the Nintendo Switch too. Thank you very much for watching me and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.